going to start documenting the invasive species that I encounter while we're here on our trip in Florida. As a curly tail lizard, as a dude, we made it to the Bahamas, Puerto Rico, Dominican Republic, basically the islands. And we're in southern Florida, and they've got quite a foothold here now. And they're kind of the king lizard in the lizard pyramid, and I guess that lizard pyramid would consist of the native lizards, the anoles, and then the next up would be these curly tails, and then the invasive tegu, and then the invasive iguana, and then I guess you could throw the Jesus lizard in there too. I've seen a couple of those in the last few days. Didn't have a care in the world. Sitting in the shade like you're sitting underneath an, a beach umbrella here in southern Florida. There's a good look. <coughs> Very large curly tail lizard. Patio. Big old stocky lizard. <laughs> And you can see why they call them curly tails. They like to eat the little anoles, the brown anoles, the green anoles, as well as a lot of other things. But uh, he's much, much, much larger than, than your anole lizard. I know what's going through that brain of his. lizard species that we've come across here in southern Florida. Look how pretty. Look how pretty. There it goes. Look at that thing. This lagoon just inside where I saw the shark. Right here coming out of the pass. There's a little kitty snorkeling area. Just, just came out of this little area right here. <laughs> it's a heck of a Jawson area. That's where all the, all the kids swim. <laughs> that big old fellow just swam out. So that was pretty, pretty interesting. I saw a big wake back in there, way back in there, and then it swam all the way around here. And then I saw it again right there, <clears throat> and it came right underneath the the walkway, and then it went on out into the channel. Let's see if I can do this. There we go. Snook.
Oh, there's a lizard. I got the lizard coming out too. There he goes. Look at the lizard. You see him? The same kinds, it almost looks like a chameleon, but it's not. I mean, you get close up on that one, yeah. interested to know what kind that is. If that's the same, like you said, it's got kind of a gecko head. It's back it. And you guys got stuff all over out yeah, here. Yeah, we have to analyze the food. You know, I haven't quite. That's got to be one of those guys. Look at how dark the tail is at the end. Yeah. Go down to the tail. Can you see the tail? A dark tail. Yeah. I think it's a, either a young or a female. Yeah. What you think? Yeah, I do. Out here. At the Jupiter Inlet. We saw that lighthouse. And there's the lighthouse that stands above everything. So, so why do they call them Jesus lizards? They can run across the water. Really? On their two back feet. So they get upright and run. Yeah. And don't they have big frills? They have a, a crown. It's um. It's just a flap like an that iguana. goes like this. It's just like a yeah, prehistoric looking iguana yeah. a little bit. Okay. All right. <laughs> just one single flap. Cool. He's on that stick. How far from us? Um about twenty feet. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's sticking straight up. Yeah. See the thing on his head? So tell me about what you just did. <laughs> well, so just after we filmed the Jesus lizard, uh, Carol peered down into the creek there and she saw <laughs> this little black racer. And uh, so I had to sneak around. It's a pretty good grab. Ah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, whoops, messing with Sasquatch, you know. Yeah. That's what we do. So anyway, so it's kind of fun to capture one of these guys. Cool. Beautiful. Should we put him down? Let's let's let him go. Yeah, here we go. Can I hold him? Uh, I don't think you want to. Okay. <laughs> wow. Here we go. Are you on him, Holly? Yeah, I got him. He's gonna do a zip. Yep. Zip zip. Bye, dude. Sorry. There's another Jesus lizard basking in the sun. There he goes. He's been really good. I'm impressed. Oh, look at that head. Mm -hmm. That is beautiful. Oh, he's making a movement. With his, he's bobbing his head. He's doing a lizard bob. Holly, how would you describe him size-wise? He's like a mid-size. They get like two or three times the size of that. You think that's a male or female, or do you know? I have no idea. Beautiful looking little animal. Yeah, I've never seen that before in my life. His head looks super large to his body, Holly. Oh, yeah. Wait until you see a big one. <laughs> have you seen him run on water? Yes. And we were back here on a kayak. 
You know, National Geographic and stuff does some super good slow motion mm -hmm. video of Jesus lizards I've running on the water. I've seen them before. Well, when you first, I, mean, uh, I didn't know like they, the I didn't almost. know they were in Florida, and then we saw something run across the rod, water on two feet. It was uh -huh. a big one. Uh huh. I was like, what? Did we just really see what well, I think Holly, we just saw? you delivered. You promised us a Jesus lizard, and you found one. That's a good one. Here, Mom, you want to get closer? You guys want to find some more? Yeah. Big old gopher tortoise. I'm gonna catch a munchie. He's facing into his hole. I'm not gonna mess with him because he's just gonna slip off into his hole if I do. Is that a pretty good size one, Holly? Yeah. It's fun when you come right across here. a munchie on the side of the road. They're so loud. So you can see his trail. He makes. Those holes can be 20 or 30 feet down the ground. A lot of things like to utilize those holes. Good eyes, Carol. <laughs> yeah, Mom. Well, something moved here and then I saw that. Uh -huh. I thought it was a. Okay, well, we'll leave him be. We won't mess with him. So there he is. That's pretty, Holly. Yeah, it's Good sunlight. How, how big is he, Holly? Foot and a half? Yeah. He's yeah. close to being one of your big ones, isn't he? Oh, uh, yeah. But they get, like I'm telling you, way bigger than him. Look, at those, him. look at those hind feet on him. Uh, I'll show you. We'll, we'll look at them up Don't move the ponies. Yeah. I'm, I'm hoping to see one. I feel like the bigger oh, ones are usually in the forest. Small. Here's a good look at a Jesus lizard. Big old thing. Some big old hind feet. And he's underneath the big palm trees on a pine limb. So there's a wild staghorn fern, and there's a, another staghorn fern up in that oak tree. That's pretty cool, Holly. Yeah. That is really cool. All right, Holly, what's on the nature moment today? We're going to see a fauna today. All right, what, what's, 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 uh, how does this uh, relate to your stomping grounds? This is where I live. <laughs> <laughs> wow. You live here? I live here. Yeah, so Intercoastal Canal? Yep. Golf course? Yep. Southern Florida? Right. Your apartment's right behind us? Mm -hmm. And you get to come out here all day long? And look at iguanas. And look at iguanas. And speaking of, there's a monster there. There's another one there. Look at them swim. Look at them go. Man, he is ugly, Holly. That thing's six feet long. There's little boat. Big boat. 
time, you're like, is he going to make it? Yeah, he's going to make it by a couple feet. That, that's probably one of the closest I've ever seen. Yeah. This is so much fun. We're sitting here on the intercoastal with inflatable yeah. rafts, speedboats, <laughs> watching golfers across the way. Look at that little dude there. That's a pretty brave little boat, Holly. That's what I'm saying. Is that a dive flag? Yep. You no, know, you take that to Peanut Island. And so they were probably out diving this morning, weren't they? Yeah. Just, just a boat parade on a Sunday morning. Everybody's starting to come out. Keep waving to everybody. Not you, people usually don't wave. Yeah, well, everybody's on with church and stuff, and Sunday fun day is the day that everyone comes out on the boat. Sunday fun day. Boy, these things are gorgeous. Four, five, six foot long. Fat, fat, fat.